Jacob Mako's founder and chairman, Jacob Arabo, has a flair for showmanship. From his background and experience in jewelry design, he has formed a vision on watchmaking that is truly unique in terms of aesthetics and technicalities. Of course, his watches involve jewelry expertise and craftsmanship, but it goes way beyond this. Jacob's imagination does not seem to be limited by technical or mechanical boundaries, and the result is that many of his watches look spectacular or even out of this world. The list of watches created is impressive, to say the least. Jacob & Co's high-end watchmaking journey comprises astonishing pieces such as the Astronomia and its evolutions. These feature spectacular kinetic movements with planetary indications that are in constant motion. It's a four-armed mechanism under the control of a multiple axis tourbillon. This mechanical marvel is protected with a transparent case with a highly domed sapphire crystal, so you can get a good view on everything from every angle. Other examples are the Twin Turbo and the Twin Turbo Furious, featuring not one, but two triple axis tourbillons together with a decimal minute repeater. And there's more. The Opera Godfather and the Opera Godfather Minute Repeater each incorporate a triple axis tourbillon and a musical mechanism playing the Godfather theme. And of course, there's a miniature Don Corleone in the center. The Bugatti Chiron tourbillon with a 16-cylinder engine on your wrist. You are the Madden that mimics the Chiron's engine, comes to life with pistons pumping up and down, and naturally it also displays the time, and it's regulated by a one-minute tourbillon. The design of these statement pieces can be polarizing, but Jacob brings something unique and fascinating to the watch industry. This is especially true in the view of the conservative style that traditional watch brands tend to follow. But you need to venture beyond the mainstream and that's exactly what Jacob Co is a force to be reckoned with in watchmaking. Ce qui rend l'horlogerie Jacob Co unique, c'est principalement l'irrévérence euh, et l'audace de nos designs, de nos propositions horlogères face à une industrie euh, très traditionnelle et parfois euh, souvent trop sérieuse, je dirais. Jacob est un créateur hors pair, un visionnaire. À chaque création horlogère, à chaque nouveau produit développé, il cherche à se réinventer et il n'arrête jamais. Partout où la standardisation est un gage de maturité et de succès, chez nous c'est la créativité et la complexité de nos produits qui nous permettent d'exister. Nos créations horlogères sont clairement plus cinématographiques que fonctionnelles. Elles représentent des scènes qui, elles, permettent une multitude d'interprétations. Et à ce titre, toutes nos montres sont des envois d'art. As a watchmaker, you see a lot of traditional watchmaking in, in, in terms of finishing and manufacturing of components of the movement. But the concept and the design of the watches or the whole world of Jacob is completely different. Is, is we are doing things that other brands are not, not even thinking about it. It is exciting because you see things you have never seen before, you were not even thinking about. And then also as a watchmaker, you can bring yourself also in because you enter new worlds and your fantasy and your knowledge is also very welcome at Jayco Company. Jacob Arabo opened his jewelry company in New York in the 1980s and quickly gained a reputation with celebrities. He started creating watches in 2002 and became famous for his diamond-studded man's watches before venturing into more technical grounds. When talking mechanical watches, the first milestone is the Quentin that was introduced in 2006. The Quentin was developed together with B&B Concept, a high-end mechanical movement specialist from Switzerland. This innovative timepiece features a vertical movement with a lateral side to be on. It also comes with an impressive 31-day power reserve that is stored in seven barrels. A major step in the company's watch activities was in 2012 when Jacob Co opened its Swiss headquarters. The brand now has two headquarters, one in New York City dedicated to jewelry and one in the world center of watchmaking, Geneva, which is dedicated to watchmaking. Here the brand develops its watches together with several long-term Swiss partners. Jacob has teamed up with some of the most talented and creative watchmakers who are able to translate his vision into the spectacular watches that Jacob Co creates. Jacob n'a pas peur de casser en guillemets, les codes de l'horlogerie dans le sens où il apportera des nouveautés que les autres marques n'ont pas réinterprétées à la mode Jacob comme on peut appeler. Et Aujourd'hui, un concept euh, qui peut paraître une idée euh, folle au départ euh, se traduit en un concept, en tout cas une montre, qui est vraiment euh, hors du commun et qui euh, apporte aujourd'hui quelque chose de nouveau, de frais dans l'horlogerie. 
c'est un peu plus d'une vingtaine d'années que Jacob, euh, on se connaît tous les deux. Et euh, d'entrée, le contact, le feeling s'est très très bien passé, dans le sens où c'est quelqu'un qui est simple d'approche, euh, au niveau, euh, tant aussi bien au niveau idée que euh, conversation, euh, j'entends entre euh, euh, patrons. Une simple idée aujourd'hui euh, qui m'apporte ou que je lui apporte, il suffit qu'on en parle 5-10 minutes et euh, tout de suite euh, naît un premier concept euh, que je partage avec mes équipes euh, au niveau du technique, le bureau technique, avec les ingénieurs, techniciens et très rapidement il y a quelque chose qui, qui naît. Aujourd'hui je le considère plus comme un, un ami qu'un client euh, parmi euh, d'autres clients que Concepto pourrait avoir aujourd'hui. It's all about relationship. How you interact and uh, create these beautiful pieces and work with watchmakers and designers and engineers. They have to love what they do for them to be able to help you. When you give them something like this to do, you give them Godfather. And they all saw this movie many times, maybe. We all did. You know, this is something completely unusual and different and nobody ever done. And not only the look wise, the complications of the watch. I spoke to engineers and my designers and watchmakers and said, we love doing this and we work extra hours, not because someone tells us to do it, because we love what we're doing. Then when I created Chiron, for example, with Bugatti, those guys are so excited working in the shop and I've seen them working. They are excited to work. It's not a boring job. It's all about relationship. It's about how interesting the job is. And that's the results. That's how you get good results. It's a teamwork, it's many people involved. I could create all day long, but if I don't have a team behind me, nothing, nothing's gonna happen. And I'm blessed to have a great team working with me.